Now we know how to use division and find the least common factor. Let's learn to subtract using this method. Hmm. I don't think I can do it by myself yet. You have to show me how to do it. Subtract by finding LCM using division method. 7 by 10 minus 3 by 5. We see that the denominators are not the same for both the fractions. Let's make the denominators the same by finding the LCM of the denominators 10 and 5. To find the LCM of 10 and 5 using division method, we write the denominators separated by a comma. Then we divide these numbers by the least prime number that divides any of these two numbers. Here we start with 2. 10 is divisible by 2, we get 5. 5 is not divisible by 2, so we write 5 as it is. We repeat the steps with the next prime number that is divisible, that is 5. 5 is divisible by 5, we get 1. Again, 5 is divisible by 5, we get 1. We then multiply the prime numbers we used for dividing. 2 times 5 equals 10. Here 10 is the least common multiple, that is the LCM. Let's make the denominators the same as 10. The denominator of the first fraction is 10, so we use it as it is. To change the denominator from 5 to 10, we have to multiply 5 with 2. Since we multiply the denominator with 2, we will also have to multiply the numerator with 2, which is 3 times 2, which equals 6. Now 3 by 5 becomes 6 by 10. Now the denominators are the same for both the fractions. That is 10. We write the denominator as 10. And we subtract the numerators. 7 minus 6 equals 1. The answer is 1 by 10. Good! One by three minus three by twelve. Thank you for watching. Enroll now. To access all 184 videos totaling 16 hours and 38 minutes, featuring introductions, examples, and exercises for grade four math.